Project Beyond. It sounds impressive, mysterious, futuristic, right? Well, it's only a working title, and the whole thing almost didn't happen. The idea for Project Beyond began in July 2020, when the founding member of our team began unpacking from a relocation and unboxing fixtures that had sat in storage and had never seen the light of day. While he could have continued making videos with some cool lighting setups and more, what capturing toilets had been known for, it didn't really feel that original anymore, even with new fixtures. Many others were now creating videos and testing fixtures at an incredibly rapid pace, and he wanted to make content that no one else was making, but didn't really know how to get there. And then, a Raspberry Pi was unpacked, a light bulb moment happened, and over the years, a few what the am I actually doing moments happened. But to make a long story short, the rest is history. The Project Beyond series, with its actual title to be revealed on February 22nd, is about deeply analyzing fixtures from yesterday and today. Why do they actually function or malfunction the way they do? How can we improve upon them without permanently modifying them? How far can we push their limits? And what's the story and history behind the fixtures and the companies that created them? We'll be telling these stories using cutting-edge filmmaking techniques in a custom-built studio and our own technology platform that integrates with the fixtures. Generation 1 of our automated tank control system was just that, and the first version couldn't even lift the flapper for reasons that soon became pretty obvious. We were trying to cut corners and adapt existing parts to our systems, and in late 2022, we abandoned that idea entirely. We've now taken an entire year to design what we now call the Advanced Fixture Test Platform. Today, we're doing final design tweaks to shrink the overall system a bit such as eliminating the ball valves in favor of dual-leaf gate systems. We can, however, finally say that after more than three full years of imagination plus research and development, and many, many failures, we're finally building production parts. And we decided to go public with this final process of getting to launch, currently targeted for just before summer. But what does all of this technology get us? A system that can automatically profile, enhance, and test the operation of our fleet of over 75 toilets. And that can give us precise data during every phase of a flush cycle. A custom suite of sensors will measure all aspects of a fixture in real time and LED arrays built into the test platform along with stage lighting and moving lights in the studio will react to sensor outputs. On the road to building the system, we've already been testing some of our improvement theories using flow regulators on the inflow and outflow sides of a given fixture. And all of this is just the beginning. Next time on the pre-launch of Project Beyond. Oops, we almost forgot something. While a commercial-style flushometer setup is being built into our modular platform, it won't be ready until later this year. But we wanted to ensure that our tank-based platform can adapt to flushometer fixtures too. With our recent acquisition of a 1982 Kilgore Argus flushometer bowl, which has one of the smallest inlet surfaces of any commercial fixture, it's becoming the template for how we will connect these type of fixtures into our modular tank system. Project Beyond won't just show you some cool photos and videos. We're going to explain why we have designed a given part of our system the way we designed it. 
the thought process that went into it, and the how-to of it all. All of that and more, coming up on Project Beyond, The Road to Launch. <laughs>